WhatsApp. Everybody is on WhatsApp today and I'm very thrilled to share some of the tips, tricks and hacks that you can use in this video. We will go through the top 10 hidden secrets in WhatsApp. I recommend you that you watch the video fully and without any further ado, let's get started. Let us see the first tip. I select on add and I want to add a photo. I just go to a gallery. I just select a picture and this is the picture I want to send. And before sending it, just click on this emoji icon. A lot of uh, emojis here. I can just click on an icon from here to here. And then continue to click on the emoji once again. And then click another emoji. Like this here. Continue further. And do something like this. And further, what I can do is I can have a call out box also. I can just select something like this. And I can position it just by turning it around. You can see that I can position the call out box as if the person is saying something. I can get a message done here. So even the bar of the callout can be changed by sliding over. So I'm going to keep the color like this and I'm going to type the text box. I'm just going to say hello and you can see the text here hello and I can change the color of the hello as well. Moving to the left I can change the font as well. So I'm going to pick this hello I'm going to say hello here and this is the message I can send. A, a GIF image. So I'm selecting a GIF here. I'm selecting one here. I'm going to the text and I can customize the message that I want. And this we have seen earlier. Now if I slide on the color palette, I can pick the color that I want. Sliding to the left will change the font. So I'm going to select this font. I can resize it and send it as a message. So it will be a personalized uh, message that we are sending. And voila. select a picture like this I can select the pencil icon you can see that there's a color palette here I can just slide around to pick the color that I want so knowing that I'm going to pick this red if I slide my finger to the left you can see here that the thickness of the pen increases or decreases so I'm going to use this to continue with my drawing so I'm going to say draw some flowers say. I'm going to change color can draw anything like this at my will and I can just kind of share it as well. So click on the emoji icon here. In this option you will see GIF and stickers. Click on stickers. And here you will see a plus symbol. Just click on this plus and this will open up a deck of stickers. You can pick whichever set that you want, sticker set. So let me go and pick this one. Now it's downloaded here. Now it's done. Let's go back and you will see that the sticker set is downloaded. So for any uh, message I want to send, I can directly send it like this. Century Achaya Zero Runs. So directly I can send that information. So this is how it looks. Let's go to some formatting now. So I'm going to type a message and uh, I want to send that message in bold font. So what I can do is I can start with a star and then uh, write the message. Say how are you and then put a question mark and then finish with the star. You can see that it is changed it to bold font. I can click send and it will go in bold. So start with a star and end with a star. So I mean an asterisk symbol and you can get the bold font. Now. So 
So imagine that I am in a group and you want to respond to a specific message here. What you can do is select this message, click on the three dot items here and say reply privately and you can send that message privately to the person to whom you want to respond to. So if I want to send a voice message, I can press on this microphone and whatever I'm talking now is getting recorded. But I have to keep pressing this uh, icon. Rather than that, I can just swipe up and pick the lock. Now you can see that the recording continues. And if I want to cancel, I can cancel here. Alternatively, when I am recording like this, and uh, if I want to cancel it right away, I can just fly to the left and it is cancelled. status to be shown to all and you want to keep it private, go to settings, in your account details, select privacy, go to status, so only the people whom you select here can see your status updates, here all contacts can see it, all contacts except specific folks you pick can see it, or you can only share it specific folks, all the three options are available for you to select. The next one. showcase to you is last seen. Suppose you don't want anyone to know when you have last accessed WhatsApp, click on last seen and you can keep keep the setting. I want no one to know my status or you can keep this as everyone so that everyone will know when you had last accessed WhatsApp. So I'm changing it to nobody so nobody will know when I last accessed WhatsApp and you can keep this information private to yourself. For tip number 10, click on the link that's in the description below. Don't forget to click on the subscribe button before you leave this page and click on the bell notification to get instant notification of the new videos that I upload. Thank you. Don't forget to give your feedback about this video in the comment section below. Subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon to get instant notification of my new videos. Thanks for watching.